time this season at Shard 10. They're off at the 1200. Telecom missile, he wasn't flash away, but he certainly wasn't as slow as what he had been uh, two and three starts ago. Day Day Rich and Cool Ace away well. Shanghai Powers into third and a length and a half to two back fourth, Alloy King. Then Lucky Mary Noel, she's running about fifth or sixth and out wider as Kel Mimi wins. Winning Warriors against the inside from Telecom Missile and one step ahead. Fire and Gold, Raging Blaze, and then came Spicy Grill. Glorious Buddy and Seven Seas last 15 lengths off the heavily backed Day Day Rich. And with 5.50 to go, he's out by a length over Shanghai Power. Cool Ace under a ride third. Then came Alloy King. Next, Kel Mimi wins from Lucky Mary Knoll. Winning Warrior next, Telecom Missile, and one step ahead, wider out from Spicy Grill. Day Day Rich with 300 metres to go. Has Shanghai Power covered by a length at the moment? Alloy King's into the clear. Lucky Mary Knoll. The others will need to get their skates on, but they're starting to join in now. Day Day Rich, Shanghai Power, Alloy King, Lucky Mary Knoll. Alloy King driving strongly. Alloy King. Alloy King wins the first from either Shanghai Power or Lucky Mary Knoll. Then Day Day Rich and one step ahead. Fire and Gold, Telecom Missile. Next in Raging Blaze, Spicy Grill winning Warrior. Well, back in the race, seventh C, Glorious Buddy, Kel Mimi wins, and Cool Ace is the last one home. Number 11, Alloy King, Antoine Hemlin for Jimmy Ting wins the first from a photo between Shanghai Power and Lucky Mary Noel, and there's absolutely nothing in that. Day Day Rich will run officially third. Barry number one, hidden away on the rail, popped out in plenty of time, and Antoine... Up to 27 for the season, wins the first. So it's, uh, let's have a look at the uh, the patrol of the first. Yeah, so the winner coming out of uh, gate number one, saving all the ground on the inside there, uh, Alloy King. You could see Telecom Missile was slow away from uh, uh, gate number nine. Kel Mimi wins, uh, goes back, but uh, shooting forward out wider is uh, Day Day Rich for Blakeshin from gate 12 and from 13, Shanghai Power comes across with him. Uh, cool Ace towards the inside. In the end, the eventual winner uh, down on the inside there, that is Alloy King. Lucky Mary, no, Kel Mimi wins covering ground. Telecom Missile's in up in midfield and one step ahead Paul the favorite to three wide in the last sort of five or six yeah he did have a little bit of cover didn't he with Cal Mimi wins in front of him but uh, he was three wide uh, most of the journey you can see getting off the rail now Antoine Hamlin on the eventual winner Alloy King and uh, perfect ride from him barrier number one he's starting to, to come into the race uh, Day Day Rich still going nice enough and Shanghai Power just coming out a bit of pressure but he stayed on well there for third end of the straight uh, here and Day Day Rich was still giving a sight with Shanghai Power just wanted to lug in a little bit uh, there was uh, Alloy King, but now he's on the straight and narrow and he's starting to charge. There was uh, runs in the middle of the track there from uh, Lucky Mary and old Telecom Missile. Uh, wider one step ahead was uh, looking to close with uh, Spicy Grill and Fire and Gold just behind there, but he's found the front here. Now is uh, Alloy King and he's uh, going to the line quite nice.